Yum. Bum bum. Bum 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 bum. Hello, Lene. Hello. What are you doing today? <laughs> Transplanting tomatoes. Nice. Yep. How old are these beautiful little tomatoes? Well, they're about teenagers now. Teenagers. <laughs> to make some. They're about, well, we started them about the first or second week of March. I got the dates inside. Yep. They're beautiful. Yes, they're happy. And you haven't even used a grow light for these, have you? No. No, which they do get slightly more uh, straggly because they reach harder for the sun. But with tomatoes, that's okay because you can plant them deep and they'll grow roots out of their stem. So it's working for us. We've, this is our second year in a row. We just don't like to have to use it if we don't have to. Um, nothing wrong with using it. But yeah, it's been working okay. We just find a nice bright south facing window. And if we need to, we move them around to where the sun is coming through the windows. Yeah. But yeah. Cool. You have about five varieties. Yep, five varieties. This one is Moneymaker. And then and we got Manitoba, uh, Tiny Tim, Amish Paste, and Cascade, which is also a cherry tomato. So we plant the tomatoes into the small cell trays that you see here. And these are awesome trays. We get them from Dubois, a Grenovation out of Quebec. And they are a distributor for Never Sink Farm, who manufactures the trays. And we're just really happy with them. They're very heavy duty. They should last us about 10 plus years. They're supposed to last 10 years on market garden scale, so they should do us for many years. Um, but we really like them. Much better than flimsy ones. So we plant the seeds into those trays, then let them grow for a few weeks until uh, you can tell that they are their root systems are outgrowing the cell. And if you don't transplant them at the proper time, it will stunt their growth because they won't have room to grow. So then they just go into, they basically stall and it can actually really set them back. So then you want to transplant them into a larger container so they can continue to develop their root systems and grow nice and big. Well, thanks for sharing, Lene. You're and welcome. Good job. Do you plan on selling any of your tomato plants this spring? Yes. I will be selling them at, uh, hopefully down at our general store, or if you're local, you can contact me through the channel or through our website. FourSeasonsNorth.com. Yep. And yeah, be great to hear from you if you're local. Yep. You can send us an email. Be great as to well. hear from you if you're not too. I just can't send you tomatoes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You can email Lene at uh, thebigglefamily at gmail.com too if you're interested. Mm -hmm. All right. Thanks yeah. a lot, Lene. Yeah. See we'll later. see you guys all later. Bye bye.